so to use this in the context of a measure let me go back to my report view and uh, let's first of all create another another uh, of this chart so let's bring this bar charts and let's put states on the axis and then what we'll put on the values is going to come after we run this calculation so right click new measure and let's call this one top five states top or let's just say top states so stop states is going to be equals to first i need to have uh the top five states stored within a list so let me call this uh variable var and i'll say top states equals to just exactly the same formula we used before that is top n and my n value is five for the table i'm going to need a list of all my states and that is all of location states that's my table and order by expression is revenue so order it by revenue let's know who are the top five states by revenue and uh, order one is descending order so order it in a descending format so the highest states are going to come first then my output which is return is going to be that it should calculate revenue comma and for the filter i'm going to have to borrow the filter function here so calculate revenue but filter for me the location table filter the location table to when the location states happens to be among that one in the top states okay so if the location state appears in the top five states that's the one i want to see so close this and close this as well hit enter so if i drop this on this my new chart now this is called top five states top states then you can see that we have exactly the same thing so what makes the measure method different from the filter spin measure is what i'm going to show you in the next video